Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. From here, we take the right hand side to the left hand side, and we have x minus 2 all raised to the power 6 minus 5 raised to the power 6 equals to 0 here. Then here, we can write this as x minus 2 all raised to the power 3. Then all raised to the power 2. Minus also here we have 5 raised to the power 3 or raised to the power 2 equals to 0 here. Then this follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket, open bracket a minus b. That is here a standing as x minus 2 or raised to the power 3. And B standing as 5 raised to the power 3. That is what we have here becomes x minus 2 all raised to the power 3 plus 5 raised to the power 3 into bracket. Also open bracket x minus 2 all raised to the power 3 minus 5 raised to the power 3 plus bracket equals to 0 here. Then, from here, we have two possible cases. The first one, x minus 2 all raised to power 3 plus 5 raised to power 3 equals to 0. Or we have x minus 2 all raised to power 3 minus 5 raised to power 3 equals to 0 here. Then, solving on this side, this follows on we have a raised to power 3 plus b raised to power 3. Which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket, open bracket, a square minus a b plus b square. That is, yeah, this becomes x minus 2 plus 5 into bracket, then open bracket, x minus 2 squared minus 5 times x minus 2 plus 5 square close bracket equals to 0 here. Then this here we have x plus 3 into bracket, open bracket. Expansion here gives us x square minus 4x plus 4. The minus 5 open this bracket, we have minus 5x plus 10. Then plus 5 squared as 25. Close bracket equals to 0 here. Then this becomes x plus 3 into brackets, open bracket x square minus 4x minus 5x, we have minus 9x. Then 25 plus 10, that's 35. Then plus 4, that's plus 39. Close bracket equals to 0 here. Then here we have two possible cases. The first one x plus 3 equals to 0. Or we have x squared minus 9x plus 39 equals to 0 here. Then solving on this side, this gives us x equals to minus 3, which is the resolution here. And here we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1, b equals to minus 9, and c equals to 39. Apply the quadratic formula, which is x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Here, what we have becomes x equals to minus minus 9 plus or minus square root of minus 9 squared minus 4 times 1 times 39 then over 2 times 1 then this becomes x equals to minus times minus is plus that's 9 plus or minus square root of minus 9 squared that's 81 minus 4 times 1 times 39 1 156 then over 2. At this year, this becomes x equals to 
9 plus or minus square root of it's 1 minus 156 give us minus 75 over 2. Okay, next step here. We can write this as x equals to 9 plus or minus square root of 25 times 3 times minus 1 over 2. That is, yeah. Now we separate this. Root 25 is 5. We take it out. We have x equals to 9 plus or minus 5. We have root 3. Then root minus 1 is i over 2. Then here we have two complex solutions. Then, solving from the second case here, this follows when we have a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3. Do the same thing as a minus b into brackets. Open bracket a square plus a b plus b square. That is here, yeah, all we have becomes x minus 2 minus 5 into brackets. Open bracket x minus 2 or square plus 5 times x minus 2 plus 5 square close brackets equals to 0 here. Then here, yeah, the same thing as x minus 7 into bracket, open bracket. Here we have x squared minus 4x plus 4. Then 5 opens this bracket, we have plus 5x minus 10, then plus 5 squared, 25, close bracket, equals to 0 here. Then this, we have x minus 7 into bracket. Open bracket x square minus 4x plus 5 is that give us plus x 25 minus 10 that's 15 15 plus 4 that's plus 19 close bracket equals to 0 here then also we have two possible cases the first one x minus 7 equals to 0 or we have x square plus x plus 19 equals to 0 here Solving on this side, we have x equals to 7, which is a real solution here as well. Also, here we have a quadratic equation. We are a equals to 1, b equals to 1, and c equals to 19. Also, applying a quadratic formula, here we have x equals to minus 1 plus or minus square root of 1 square minus 4 times 1 times 19 over 2 times 1 that is yeah we have x equals to minus 1 plus or minus square root of 1 square is 1 minus 4 times 1 times 19 that's 76 over 2 that this here we have x equals to minus 1 plus or minus square root of 1 minus 76 minus 75 over 2. That is, next step here, we can write this as x equals to minus 1 plus or minus square root of 25 times 3 times minus 1 over 2. When we separate this with 25, that's 5, we take it out and we have x equals to minus 5 plus or minus 5, then we have root 3 and root minus 1. Yeah, that's the same thing as i then over 2. That is also we have two complex solutions here and therefore altogether here we have six solutions in this problem. Two real solutions here, two complex solutions here and two complex solutions here and thank you for watching. Don't forget this step. Subscribe for more videos. Turn the notification bell and share this video with thumbs up and put your comments. See you next time. Bye for now.